Welcome back, guys, for some more Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Let's, uh, first off, we're going to hit this meditation point here. Collapsed Passage. So, still not allowed to fast travel. So, I still can't uh, go back and show you guys the loot that I found. Um, skills, we do have a couple of skill points available. Let's see what we've got here. So that focus sight's been what I've kind of been messing with lately. We played a little bit with it in the last episode, just kind of working on our proficiency and the timing and trying to figure out exactly how the mechanic works. Um, teamwork reduces required time to heal. That could be good. Additional life. And then increase our maximum life. And we're really close to getting a third skill point as well. Let's look at these a little bit. I'm primarily going to be... Well, so far, primarily going to be doing the um, single and the double-bladed lightsaber. I like that combination. Improved footwork. Cyclone Slash. X after a basic attack to perform a powerful overhead swing. That's two skill points. Um, I wonder, so to get, oh, we just go straight up to get that aerial assault. I wonder if we should get something for our double blade, you know, just pop a point in and then start seeing what these are. Um, let's do that. We're going to pop uh, just one point here. Yeah, we're going to do it. Hold X to deal fast strikes towards a single enemy. That might be pretty good for uh, after you kind of do a little bit of crowd control just to dispatch dispatch somebody really quick. Vortex dive. Does that the first one does not use force. This one does. LB and press X to dive forward while spinning the lightsaber. Um, let's just take a look at that. That sounds kind of cool. Oh. That is cool. It doesn't... Does it look like it does a ton of damage? I mean, the, the guy on the right, his stamina bar went down pretty decent, but the left guy, not too much. Okay. And then what do we got? Endless Hurricane. Continue pressing X to add additional attacks to the end of the double-bladed attack chain. So basically that just gives us more combos, it looks like. Which, that's pretty cool. That's a, that's a one-pointer. And then the, the... Oh, double orbit. Vortex dive. Uh, this looks like a lightsaber throw one. Powerful overhead swing. That's a two-pointer. I'm, I'm going to pick this one up here, too. Just so we can increase. Yeah, I like that. Because it does seem it's like it's a little slow. Okay, yep. BD stim canisters refill some force meter. That's a two-pointer as well. That might be the next one I go for. Um, 
We'll see. Oh, okay. keep doing this. I'm ready. Keep forgetting to rash actually rest. All right, I am ready now for sure. Almost reminds me of the Jedi training grounds, but it feels different. Older. It, it really reminds me of a like a Zepho temple. I'm digging. I'm digging the the art and the visuals for this this section though. It looks really cool. Something up there. Ooh, there is something up there. Is there um there's a way to double back because it looks like this is just a wall run here. Can I go backwards? Yes, I can. Cool. What is this? Looks like a data disk. A data disk? That's new. Continue exploring the galaxy to discover this treasure and who finds it valuable. So, looks like all this stuff has basically the same description on it. To be continued. Nothing else back up top anywhere. Oh, okay. That looks like death and death, right? The only reason I'm saying maybe not death is because we kind of did the, the slide. Down. Yeah, it's death. What is this place? I'm telling you, Zepho Temple. What up, BD? What do you got? Disaster. That sounds ominous. Huge masses of rock fell through the roof and slammed into this subterranean sanctuary, indicating intense seismic activity above ground. Probably, maybe from, like, mining and stuff, if this is a, a mining area. The power's still running down here. Let's see if we can hit the lights. Chamber of Duality. Jedi Chamber. Anything pop up on that? Interesting. What's that? I don't know. Can I grab it? Oh, I can. I just can I put it in here? I just drop it. I do. Not bad. Think we could walk on that? I mean, it looks a little creepy and watery, but yeah. Where'd you go, BD? What are you doing, man? Is there something you want to scan somewhere, BD? That was kind of weird. Careful, BD. Is that a guard or a training dummy or something? I came as soon as I could, Master Kree. Sorry, what is this? this? This is cool. Will it be a complete memory purge? No. 
Only what the council demanded. Then at least, I shall remember you. I am ready. What is your name, droid? I am ZNA4, of course. How may I serve the order? Z. Tell me how to navigate the Kobo Abyss. I have no information on that in my memory bank. Oh, is that, uh, that that thing we saw when we popped out of Master hyperspace? You are aware the Republic has issued a full-scale evacuation order. I am. That is why I have a very important task for you, Z. Take this. A tuner? Oh, what a fine model. Oh, that's the the thing the uh, the pirate guy was looking for. Use that to open the forest array. Travel underground. Stop for no one. That is an order, Z. Am I not coming with you? No. The key to Tanalor is in that array. If you do not hurry, I fear it will be lost forever. I am really the digging. With you. Um, her outfit there. That's a really cool Jedi robes. Yeah, BD, I agree. has been here for hundreds of years. Let's take a look at our databank here. ZNA4, also known as Z. Z is a droid from the High Republic era, tasked by Jedi Master Santari Kiri, or Santari Kree, to recover the key to Tantalor. She immediately takes to Cal, although she questions his unconventional attire. I didn't hear her question my attire. Uh, let's go. I'm pretty sure something popped up too about the High Republic. Where would that be at? Characters, databank main. As meteors streak across the Kobo sky, Centauri Cree charges the droid ZNA4 or Z to recover the key to Tantalor from the forest array. Okay. Go back to databank main. Here we go. High Republic. The High Republic was an era of expansion and exploration, with Jedi helping lead the push to discover the greater galaxy and fold willing planets into the galactic community. The dangers that lay on the edges of their understanding, however, would prove a constant challenge. So yeah, the High Republic era is something that is very interesting to me as, as kind of a Star Wars nerd. Um, it's it's basically the the I don't want to call it the dawn of the Jedi era because that was you know we could we could talk for hours about uh, the evolution of the Jedi uh, but the High Republic era was an interesting time and there was there's lots of cool stories from that uh, era that I've read either through there's some High Republic novels and then also um, the uh, Star Wars uh, Knights of the Old Republic video game. But that's cool that they are um, bringing that into this game. Man, I just, I love Star Wars. 
Star Wars is awesome. All right, what are we trying to do here? Do we need to just like slash this? No. Okay. All right, so it looks like we've got we've got a bridge that goes that way. We got some goodies over there. Uh, it looks like this is probably what we're supposed to do is take this. Uh, I am, yes. Not completely, Z. I'm a Jedi, all right. But you're not even wearing the proper robes. I'm more of a poncho guy. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um. So it looks like this one maybe takes two to fully activate. Doesn't look like that's gonna that's gonna get it done. So we'll go over here. I suppose along the way we can pick up another one of those glowing balls and Is there a way to get over there? Can I run on this wall? No. Thinking I can maybe shimmy through there. Do we have to uh, keep taking this ball everywhere we go? Uh oh. Well, that's good. Actually, I think that might be glowing. Oh, that's cool. Is that glowing with like, the force? Can we do something? Yeah. Okay. Use the orbs to activate the bridge. Then you can reach the green controls. Uh, I think. After so many idle years, who really knows? This droid's got more than a screw loose. What was that? I uh, said, hold tight, Z. Hold tight, Z. We're coming. See if there's any secrets in here. Yes, sir. High Republic data disk. I bet Z would have some use for it. I got force field. Hmm. Is there a way we can? In this door? What happens if I take this and put it there? No? What's that up there? Whoa. <laughs> hey, Cal. Don't stand on the uh, bridge. The force bridge. When you take out the thing that controls the force bridge. Can I throw that up there? That almost looked like something you could uh stick one of these balls in. I'll have you free soon, Z. Very soon. I've only been hint here for a while. I didn't have your name in my databanks. When did you pass the trials? Never took them. I was knighted in the field. And what was the reason for this flagrant breach of protocol? It's a long story. Actually, it's a pretty short story, Z. Uh, the Jedi Order is no more. The breach of protocol is the least of the concerns right now. Jedi paint. Weapon materials. Okay, cool. So that's going to be... Something we can put on our lightsaber. Okay, so... Take one of these balls. 
stick it here? No. I thought that's... Oh, wait. This is, uh... Something different. We gotta go and grab this thing. What did that do? Oh, cool. Uh, okay. Really cool design on this droid too. It reminds me of the uh, Zepho, uh, like the Tomb Guardians, just kind of the. What? A bastion of the Order's light on the galactic frontier. At least that's what my master hoped Tannalor might become. should do it for now. Just gotta figure a way out of this place. Well, I can help with that. It's this... Was it that? No. Oh! Yes, it is this way. Follow me. Oh, now I see where we are. A Jedi Temple. Temple. Master Kree designed these to train Jedi. I remember this. Don't recall what it does, however. Master Kree had a brilliant mind. Do you know her, Cal? Can't say I do. No matter, but I think she would have liked you. I need to get out of here. I am very fortunate you came along when you did. Yeah. We'll hit that up in a little bit. I just want to see. What's it like? Tanalo? Oh, what a wondrous place! How do I get there? Navigate the Kobo Abyss. That must be the knowledge your master purged from your memory banks. Well, she must have had her reasons. Holy cow. <laughs> Better watch out, BD. Some Jawas might get one of your legs. You too, Z. Cut unlocked. How do I get back there? Uh, funny that Z mentioned proper attire. Z, I want you to just hang out right there for a second. And I am going to go show y'all what we got.
southern reach. There should be like a stable thing up here somewhere. Uh, that's a place that had like that laser turret. Where is it at? Is it up here? That that uh, whole sequence there was very interesting, though. It'll be really cool, kind of learning more about the High Republic. I mean, I'll eat up whatever knowledge of that they want to give. Where is that stable at? Oh, there it is up there. Samsonite, I was way off. And so, yeah, I wonder... So that's got to be the abyss that we have to navigate. And uh, a Jedi temple up there, that's pretty pretty cool. Alright guys, so here we are. We've got a chest that we found here. Let's take a look and see what's inside. Oh, a man beard. Look at that. And let me show you guys what else was in the other chest. So I'll show you where I picked it up. Uh, it was back... Let's see, in the Gorge Crash site. So, um, if you guys will recall, there was like a lake of tar kind of right here, and we kind of hopped our way across, and then that's how our path went this way. But there was also a little lake over here, and I didn't really explore that. So I went and explored it, found a uh, Priorite crystal, and then also there was a chest. And that chest contained yes the mullet and that guys is where we're going to leave off this episode when we come back we are going to keep exploring with Z and see if we can get back down into uh, that Jedi meditation chamber because I think there was uh, maybe um, like a little training session or something there because uh, Z mentioned that her master built it to train for training. So anyway, guys, hope you are enjoying the game and we will catch you in the next one. Peace.